Imagine if your image of the world were based exclusively on images of it at night. Images of continents created exclusively by the tiny beacons from cities and towns. Now while it might be possible to glean an understanding of the world by this method, it would take a lot of energy and money to make it light up enough to get a reasonable picture of it, and there would probably be things you'd miss. However, this is, in fact, how we sequence human DNA today, by making it light up. A DNA base, the basic unit that makes up an individual's genetic code, is approximately 0.3 nanometers away from its neighbor. The wavelength of light is at least 400 nanometers, or more than 1300 times as big. It is for this reason that those using light to sequence DNA must label DNA bases in order to read them. This labeling makes sequencing expensive, slow, and prone to error. Imagine if there were a different way. Imagine if we were able to sequence DNA without having to make it light up. We'd save a lot of money and energy, and we might even see things that we would have missed otherwise. Instead of using light, NABSYS is developing a method of sequencing DNA electronically. Electronic sequencing promises to be extremely cost-efficient, fast, and accurate. It is what will allow DNA sequencing to move out of the research lab and into clinical practice. Right now, we treat cancer based on the organ of origin, the stage, how advanced it is, and the grade basically what it looks like under a microscope. From experience, oncologists try to determine whether a given tumor is likely to respond to one kind of chemotherapy or to another. However, in too many cases, this approach does not work. Too often, there's an initial response followed by a point where the tumor is thought to develop resistance to the treatment. Some cells which respond to one type of chemotherapy are destroyed leaving behind those that are resistant to that therapy. Imagine if we could go deeper into the tumor. We could understand ahead of time that some cells will be responsive to one therapy while others will be responsive to another therapy. We would be able to correctly choose the right combination therapy for each individual patient. Imagine if we could know ahead of time which diseases we are at greatest risk for, which medicines to take to help prevent them, and which medicines to avoid because they would have made us sicker. This is the promise of personalized medicine. This is the promise of electronic DNA sequencing. This is the promise of NABSYS.